everybody and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Unity, also known as the game with the longest ass loading screen. I swear to god, like I was trying to like load up this game, took a good five minutes. So that's always fun. Anyway, so I know it's been a while, and it's it's simply because uh, that first two episodes were without commentary, which was super shitty. I apologize for that. I should not even, uh, like... I should have thought about the fact that I wasn't recording my audio. That was pretty stupid of me. But, uh... Yeah, so I have not played for a good two weeks. So let's see how well I do, considering that. It's funny, too, though. I played the game without knowing how shitty it was on con- not console, on, uh... <laughs> on, uh, shit, sorry. How shitty it was on PC. And just hearing everybody complaining about the game makes me super happy because I haven't had any problems with it yet. I don't know if there are on PlayStation 4. Probably not, I would assume. But, uh... Just the fact that there are problems, it just is such like a, oh, Ubisoft, you bastards. Anyway, let's jump into this. Enough ribble rabble. Oh, oh, loading screen. I feel like I should put a clock on all of the, oh shit, that was quick. Mission. Let's get your arse in position. Your last question is piss pop. I live to serve. Wow, that was very descriptive. Thank you. Where's my position? Am I just killing these people then? Okay, I mean, whatever. Oh, shit. It's coming from someone who's not very good at these Assassin's Creed games. Just saying. Sabotage. Kill, 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 kill. Gotcha. Off with you, beggar. Oh shit, what the hell happened? Oh, okay. Man, I love this sword. It's great. Sabotage. Well, that was it for that whole mission? Okay. I mean, that felt pretty easy. Oh, never mind. Lord Guillaume de Roussel has generously agreed to our price of 40%. An act of desperation? What about the priest? You'll come around. <laughs> Your confidence is infectious, Seabear. My boys will have the weapon ready. Here are the details. Make sure it goes smoothly. Of course. Make sure that it goes smoothly, cretin. These bastards always have bodyguards. Well, damn, do that before he starts screaming. Why do we hang about here when Sibert still lives? He killed Monsieur de la Serre. Patience, Sibert is not the target. Not today. Come on, Council's waiting for our report. Yeah, let's go then. I don't know why I didn't follow him through that. Whatever. No, go. Just jump. Oh my god, man. What kind of Assassin's Creed game is this where I can't make a thousand mile jump? Time to learn your hate. Hold R1 and release to throw smoke bomb enemies. Oh. Just kill him.
Can't see shit. Can't see shit. Was that a parry? I didn't see. Boom. There you go. Let's go. Just, I don't care about looting, really. Oh, okay. There's still one more luck. How do you have such trouble taking these guys down? Like, it's like a two-hit kill for all of them. Where are we going? Where are we going, man? I will follow your lead, master. Right in the spinal cord. Can I just say, by the way, I'm really surprised that your father wasn't a Templar. Like, it was just weird to me that I felt like he was going to be a Templar. Are we running or what are we doing, dude? Okay, or just don't help. Oh, you're so easy. Get him off balance my ass. Look at this sword. It's killing them instantly. Damn, I'm like a lightsaber wielding dude in this game. Like, no one can fight this shit. I wish they would tell you on the map where you're going, because I do not want to follow this guy if the dude I'm supposed to be following is slower than me. Merde. Patriots. These imbeciles will pick a fight with anyone. Try not to draw their attention. It's gonna be kinda hard with all that blood on you. Stop them. Avoid them. Doesn't matter. There's always more fanatics. Can't save everyone, piss pop. Well, there's a cheery thought. What is happening suddenly? Jesus Christ. Relax, everybody in the world. So I'm just going to take a wild guess and say that there's going to be an upgrade where I can move faster in this game. Like, holy crap, I feel like I move so slowly. Around, dude. No, down. I'm hitting circle, by the way, everybody. Nope. Don't care. Doing straight up missions right now. I'm busy, world. Okay, sure. Yeah, I don't like running through the buildings. Sure, just jump now. Now I'll run through a building, of course. You know, right when I say I don't want to. Skew. Oh, you get caught up on shit way too easily in Assassin's Creed, by the way. That's an aesthetic that needs to change. Just the fact. And I wish that the movement was just a little bit more X, dude. You're going up, not down. Like, the movement in this game is like, yeah, it's a little bit more fluid. But sometimes I feel like that makes it worse. Because you are just all over the place and you're like no I didn't want to go there didn't want to go there game and you get caught up on shit you should be able to jump up on and I know if white boy's watching he's gonna be on my ass about saying all this shit cuz he's like oh shut your whore mouth about Assassin's Creed oh shit are we gonna fight okay cool I don't really want I don't care Oh, shut up, dude. I can't believe this. We've not seen C there for a year, and you're letting him walk. All because his name wasn't on a bloody piece of paper. The timing's not right. Too many variables. Too many loose threads. And welcome back to loading screen, Unity. What's up with that? Can someone tell me what that is where every new next-gen game feels like it takes a thousand hours to uh, 
to do, to goddamn like switch to like then? load. I mean, we take this ledger full of Templar records from Mirabel. Killed last night. Wasn't us. Templars have been killing each other like he's going out of fashion since eighty-nine. A Templar civil war. Sees himself as a great peacemaker. Make our lives Where'd you go? War between assassins and Templars. dogs and cats can live together in peace. Then that's bad. It's a self-aggrandizing pipe dream. The Templars are at their weakest since Jacques de Malib. Shit! Cut that off too quick. The customs agents of France can rest easy. Arthur North dead. Shaking down imprisoned nobles seems a bit out of reserve. What are the Templars up to? We hadn't spent the last year hobbled by your damn truce. We might know that. He has a point, Honoré. The truce was with Grandmaster de la Serre. The man's been dead for two years. Whoever's in charge now, you can be certain they aren't sitting idle. We might have learned more had we not allowed Sivert to escape. Sivert was there? I know your heart is set on keeping the peace. But bringing Monsieur de la Serre's killer to justice would count for something, wouldn't it? Yes, it would. But do not confuse your personal vendetta with a sound strategy. He wants to kill Templars. Let him kill Templars. I've done all I can. Boy's ready. Very well. Assassin. I charge you to go to Notre Dame de Paris and to find there the Templar agent, Charles Gabriel Sibel. You will learn his secrets, and when you have done so, you will bring him peace in accordance with our tenets. Hell yeah. Do I just leave out the way I came, or is there another way I have to get out here? By the way, I find it weird that the entrance to this place is in a sewer. It's like, I think people back then probably were in the sewers more, weren't they? Like, people went into the sewers. Especially if it was such an easy place to find. It's literally on the, on the, uh, one of the most open sewer things I've ever seen. Another side note, it's really gross that it leads right into the river. Over here. No, that didn't mean anything. It's in the middle of the loading screen because this game is awesome like that. It's funny though, I said this already. It's great to me that this game is doing so bad review wise. But I'm having a fire time. I mean, it's not my, my game of the year. Well, who the fuck? I mean, I just, I'm just going to do the main quest, guys. I'm sorry. It's not my favorite game of the year, obviously. I feel like that's going to be Dragon Age. But if I can swim in this game, sweet. It's not bad, though. I mean, it's better than some games. I would say it's probably better than Alien Isolation, definitely. I don't even know what are the games I have played this year on the list that it would be better than. Nope, that way, dude. I mean, one of my only problems, I don't know, the controls feel, feels weird. Uh, the city is definitely more full than any other Assassin's Creed game I've ever played. But, uh, I mean, the character is, is another thing for me. The character just feels like a rehashed version of, uh, of Ezio. Which is like, oh, that's kind of cool, I guess, because I love Ezio. But, he's just like, it's like, well, they knew that Ezio worked, so they were just going to make another version of him. You know what I mean? Like, that's not... I feel like there should be more variety with that kind of thing. Like, everyone... But then... Then the thing is... Everyone hated Connor. Because he literally... Because he wasn't Ezio. And that's stupid. Ez, Connor was fine for the character he was. He grew up in a very different time than Ezio. And... Let's do it. 